When you play Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, or Warzone, do you keep getting the annoying error code 6 and Diver? When you get error code 6 in Call of Duty Warzone, it means that the game client can't download and install an update. It has mostly been seen with PC players of COD Warzone, but there have also been a few Xbox One and PS4 users who have had the same problem. Here's how to fix it. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issue so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. First, you must verify the server status. Error code 6 isn't usually caused by a problem on the server, but if you get it during an update, you might want to check for any problems that are still going on. Go to the official activation support page to see if there's a server issue. If the servers are having trouble, you might want to download the update later and see if the COD Warzone error code comes back. Next is reboot your modem or router. COD Warzone error code 6 could be caused by network equipment that doesn't work. Make sure you turn off your modem or router, unplug it from the power source for 30 seconds, and then plug everything back in. Next, turn off your Windows Firewall. If you play Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, and Warzone on a PC, turning off your Windows Firewall is another thing you can try. If the game client is having trouble connecting to the server, turning off the firewall may help. Next, use a different network when updating. Some players who got a COD Warzone error code said they were able to fix it by switching to cellular data instead of the normal internet connection. So, if you usually connect your PC, PS4, Xbox One, or any other console to your Wi-Fi, try using a cellular data connection before you try to download the game or system update again. Lastly, reinstall Warzone. If none of the solutions work, you might want to delete the game and reinstall it. Keep in mind that this is a drastic solution because you have to download the whole game and all of its updates, which is more than 100 gigabytes. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.